question. Does it need more hours? Um, I don't Blink. know. Hours, Muzzy. Um, I don't know, man. You're the director, so up to you. I am the director. Play it again. We have a room for Kashim Award, Brisham and the Hossa Malk and Lassa. Pause it. Right there. Did you see that? Oh, man, I want to see much, much more of that. Like, oh, like I want to make that arsehole look darker. I mean, like, oh, almost evil. Like an evil, evil arsehole. Yeah, no, no bother. Excellent, excellent, excellent. Love your work, man. Man. Mossy, I want you to work on my next movie. When you're done with this, really, I, like, I need you. What's it about? Well, it's a power movie, obviously. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm fine. Why the fuck not? Because I don't want to be a porn editor. You are a great editor. Why would you not want to edit the next movie, man? Because you told me this was going to be a love story. It is a love story, Mossy. <laughs> with fucking. Look, I, I appreciate the offer and all that, I really do, but I'm only doing this freelance work to get a bit of cash. Huh. I've actually just written my own script, so I'm actually trying to get that going. What's the movie about? It's a love story. Is there any writing in it? No, no. It's just just a normal love story, just plain and simple. It's... Look, I actually just want to be a director, so that's kind of what I want to do. That's my passion. I hear you, man. I hear you. You have dreams. Mm. You're chasing them. I'm chasing mine. Yeah. I respect it. Best of luck to you, Mossy. 100% man. Get it. Sam, man. Cheers. Let's get back to this now, though. Alright. <laughs> What's the crack? Story, Robert. How much? They said in the wedding video here. Eh, uh, just call and see if you're still up for coming to pitch me script with me tomorrow. Not tomorrow? Yeah. Oh, I completely forgot, man. Sorry. I'm shooting the wedding tomorrow. I 
But I told you about this a month ago. I know, but I need the money. Like, sorry. You'd be grand anyway. What do you want me there for? What am I gonna do? Stand in the corner like a creep? Shit! It's shit. I like it. You do? Yeah, yeah, I do. I think a movie about lesbians is exactly what we need right now. Uh... There, there's no lesbians in it. No lesbians. No, did, did you not read it? Yeah, I glanced through it. I swore I seen lesbians. Is that your ending? Yeah. And you're going with that? I guess so, yeah. Keep trying. It's shit. Come on. No, it is. I mean, people have seen this movie a thousand times. Yeah, but maybe the audience will relate to it because it's grounded and realistic. It's not grounded and realistic. It's beige and it's boring. Look, I'm not saying that you're a bad writer. I'm saying this is a bad script. My advice, write something new. And this time, Jazz it up a bit. Okay, look, you need three things in a movie. Okay, you need fights, explosions, and tits. And a car chase. Yeah, but that, that's not the type of film I'm trying to make. It's supposed to be a romantic love story. <laughs> Nobody's gonna love this. Okay, look, look, I see where you're coming from, okay? You have this big dream and you put your heart and soul into it and all that kind of stuff, but I'm telling you, this movie isn't gonna get made. Nobody wants to see this movie. Well, I disagree. There are plenty of people just like you going around every day and getting the same answer. And you know what they do? They take it on the chin and they start again. You don't know shit. I don't know shit. I've been in this business for 30 years. I've produced some of the biggest Irish movies ever made. No, but maybe you're right. Maybe you're right. Maybe I don't know shit. So? Look, clearly, you're driven. Okay? And, and, and you're motivated. Okay? But you are going to have to get a tougher skin if you want to survive in this business. Right, you are going to be hearing no every single day. It is going to be a long, cold, dark, negative journey. 
Okay, now I'm sorry that I couldn't give you the story that you wanted to hear today, but in my opinion, you need to burn this script. You need to write something else because this movie is never getting made. Do you understand what I'm saying to you? Yeah. You all right? Yeah, I'm fine. Good, it's just, you kind of look like you might start crying. <clears throat> no. No, I'm, I'm good, yeah. Yeah, I'm good. Okay. Look, it was nice to meet you, but I've got to be somewhere. So, you've got this, right? <laughs> so what happened today? I don't want to talk about it. I'm sure it was constructive criticism and you can take what they said and then work on it and make your script even better no because it's not gonna happen it is gonna happen it's not gonna it happen. is gonna happen it's not what did they say they said it was the biggest piece of shit they'd ever read and it'll never get made right so uh <sighs> What am I going to do, man? I've clearly hit rock bottom. I need to find out who I am. Will you shut up? You're going on as if it's over. So you showed a few producers your script and they said no. Think, think how many shit movies are made every year, Mossy. All right? Your movie could be one of those shit movies. It could. I'm just fed up here, no. I mean, today, today was soul crushing. So what? Uh, you just give up? What else am I supposed to do? Look, Mossy, it's not about how hard you can get hit, all right? It's about how hard you can hit and keep on hitting until I can't fucking remember it, but you'd be pumped if I said it, man. Look, let's just have a few balls, like we said. Uh, speaking of shit movies, man. I know what we could watch. What? Those were the good old days, man. I didn't realize how bad they were, man. Jeez, the acting. <sighs> Looking back on it, though, man, I think we've done a pretty great job. Yeah, it wasn't bad for a bunch of kids. I mean, if we put that much effort into making a film as a kid, how much what we could do now? I mean, anyone can make a film that looks professional. The only problem is the distribution. That's it. Yeah. Why don't we do this ourselves? Because it'll be shit if we do it. I don't know how to shoot a movie, man. My movie is a love story.
You literally shoot love stories for a living. You'd be well able for it. Do you want to make a movie? Yes. We have the script I can direct. I can shoot the full movie on my high definition 4K camera. We can do it on our own time, our own budget. I have all the equipment we need. Lenses, lights, filters, determination. I can edit it from the comfort of my own home. Man. We can do this. We can do this. 100% we can do this. Should we do this? 1000% we can do this. Let's do this. Yeah. Those producers can go fuck themselves. Yeah. We don't need them. We can do this on our own. We don't need anybody. You don't look so good. I don't feel good, man. Maybe you need to take a shit. I already tried and it's not working. There's a bug going around. Is there, yeah? Yeah, my dad had it. Alright, yeah, I think I... I think I'm... Uh, what about cast then? Uh, we'll put an audition online, say open call for a new feature film, and make you into a star. And just see who shows up. I mean, all we really need is two cast. A guy and a girl, so shouldn't be too hard. Eh? Cool. Uh, locations. Uh, we just use locations owned by family or friends. Throw in some free advertisements for any shops or businesses, so that should do them nicely. Uh, no payment then. No, no. I mean, we don't even have any money, and we're not getting paid ourselves, so. But I'll write up a list of everything involved so people know what they're getting themselves into. There'll be no pay for cast or crew, cast will come in their own clothes, everyone brings their own food. Yeah. Sorted. But here man, um, I'm gonna save up some money so I can at least pay you. Massey, will you stop? I don't want your money. Man, I'm paying you and that's it. You're not gonna pay me, I don't want your money. Look, if. Just put it towards the movie if that's the case, okay? I just wanna, I just, I said yes because I wanna help. I wanna make a good movie and, you know, I think it'll be a really cool experience. But yeah, man, I promise you, we're not gonna make a good movie. We're gonna make a fucking great movie. <sighs> yes, we are. <laughs> Now come on, read back to me what I just said. What? The notes you took. I'm not taking notes, man. I'm, I'm just drawing. That's a pretty good drawing. Thanks. Yeah, I impressed myself actually there. in the head knock like this right and he was like don't go mad he's trying to get out like, oh yeah not going anywhere he's like that is impossible to get out you, did you ever watch UFC I watched all Ultimate Fighter you guys see the whole lot like there's no getting out of it and I stole your man's watch as well look at that I haven't got a clue what it does it does loads of mad shit but good turn out for me So anyway, me and Rob are making a movie at the moment and we were wondering if you'd be interested in helping out at all. Do you just want me to act? Uh, well, we were more thinking we also really need someone strong, you know, to do like really important stuff like mm. holding up lights mm. or... Um, Lifting heavy equipment, maybe some stunt coordination. Uh, you could show us how to throw a punch. It's just like an act, you know. 
Fine, I'm sure I can find something for you. But nothing major now, just something small, all right? Yes! <sighs> hey, should you be doing that? What? Smoking with the baby in the room? She doesn't mind. Fuck you. The sound you're hearing right now is two sausages rubbing off each other. Lovely sausages. <sighs> What's up? Uh, we came because we want to talk to you about something. All right. Look, I'm just going to cut to the point, yeah? We're going to make a movie, I'm directing, Rob's going to be DLP. We need someone to do sound. And we thought you might be up for it. Yeah, sure. Is that it? What, what do you want me to say? I don't know, uh, ask about if you're getting paid or not. Are we getting paid? No. no. All right, I'm in. All right, cool. Anyone want a sausage? Uh, sorry. <clears throat> Excuse me. Hello. What? Hi. Um. Uh, we were told we could use one of the rooms today for um some auditions we're doing. Casting couch or something, is it? No. No, it's just a normal movie. Look, there's there's no sex involved. Is, is that alright? Yeah! Use any room you want! Now fuck off! Alright, thanks. Cheers. Our first actor's here. No way. Already? Yeah. Quick, get in there, man. Come on. What's he look like? Uh, a bit of a pedophile. Fuck. So, I am Mossy, and this here is Rob. How are you? Uh, I'm Luke. Nice to meet you, Luke. Um, before we get started, um, we just want to ask, uh, do you have a job or are you in college or school or something? Um, no, I, I don't have a job at the moment and um, I dropped out of school in my final year because I was getting bullied quite badly. Perfect, man. Yeah, that is, that is that's great news. Yeah, I'm ha happy to hear that. So, um, yeah. There's the scene you'll be doing. You'll be reading for the part of Jack. So, take it from the top whenever you're ready. Cool. You're like professionals. Yeah, we are. Have you had many people in so far? You're the first person, actually. <laughs> She's so important. You should. This is some serious shit, man. Is it? Yeah. Hollywood, here I come. Look, will you just read the scene, man? Yeah. <coughs> hey, how are you? Uh... Alright, your shit. Thanks for coming in, man. 
Goodbye. Oh, wait. No, I'm sorry, we've actually cast the whole movie already. But you said I was the first person to audition. Goodbye. Okay, look, um, I, I don't want to be an actor. I've never acted before in my life. So if you don't want to act, then what are you doing here then? You see, I saw online that you're making this movie and I wanted to see if I could help out in some way. I, I love movies. I, I want to work in movies when I get older. What department do you want to work in? I want to be a producer. And I, I know you have a producer already on board, but I just want to see if I could get some on-set experience with professionals like yourselves. Oh, I'm sorry, but we don't have time to be teaching kids the ropes. Goodbye. Thank you. Uh, the door's right there. I'm at a stage in my life now where I don't care about anything or anyone. I am fed up of people's lies. You try and be a good person and people just spit it back in your fucking face. What's with the, what's with the hands? What do you mean? You're, you're doing it right now, you're just like kind of... I don't think there's anything wrong with the way I'm reading the script here, okay? You guys maybe need to, you know, pick up your act a little bit. Fine, Jack. Just walk away like you always do. I'll be gone. I'll be somewhere. I'll be happy without you. Que no, que ya me salgo de aquí, que me estoy saltar puto coño, ¿sabes? Fine, Jack. Just walk away like you always do. God forbid you put me first for a change. But you're too much of a self-centered prick to care about anyone but yourself. You see you lot, yeah? I don't fucking care about none of you, man, yeah? I'ma fuck all of you, man, up. Because all you use are rats and snakes. Shiv shav slank! I don't give a fuck, Brittany. You know what I mean? You try and be good people and people spit in your face. I can smell your dick. It, 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 it stinks of, of, of your mother. So, Ben, I see you've done a load of work on stage and you did perform an arts college for four years. Yeah, uh, well I just finished college this year actually, so I'm looking to get into either TV or film. Um, I have only done plays and I worked a bit in theatre, but this will be my first time acting in front of a camera. But that's just amazing because your tape on camera, man, was just beautiful. <laughs> Thank oh, you guys. We think you're just perfect for the part, man. How do you feel about working for free? Well, look, I mean, I know that this business is very hard to get into, um, and I'm just starting off, but I mean, I think we're in the same boat here, guys. I mean, you guys have no money, but you look like talented people. If there's one thing I want to do in this business, it's work with talented and creative people. Well, that's good to hear, man, because, you know, we are, and, and we want the same things. Yeah, we've got no money, but, you know, we're, we're passionate, and we just want to make something Great. Yeah. I mean, I'd love to be involved in this as my first feature film. If you guys will have me, of course. But, I mean, look, I'm, I'm finished college. Um, I don't have a job. I'm available at any time, any day. <laughs> You're hired. Welcome to the movie. I fucking say that. Welcome to the movie. <laughs> yeah, lads. Closing up now. No worries, we were just heading on there anyway. Yeah, I forgot about just. What's it about? It's about a man and woman who fall in love. Sounds bent. Sound. Did you just get everything you need then? 
Uh, well, no. We didn't get the main female character, unfortunately. How come you haven't found her yet? Because I haven't found the person I'm looking for. I need her to be tall with red hair. Why does she have to have red hair? Because that's how I have her written in the script. Just change it to a different hair colour. Yeah, like... <clears throat> blonde with brown roots. Because, Robert, that's how I've got it written in the script. I can't change it. You still haven't shot anything yet. So why don't you just change the hair colour to whoever suits the part? If you could just fuck off, that'd be great. Can I audition? <laughs> Sorry, what? Give me a shot at it. Have you ever acted before? No. Would you stop? Just let me audition for the crack I told you I've never done it before. No, I'm sorry, but we're tired and we were just about to go home, so... I'm gonna say yes. What? All right, fine. Come on, sit down. So I just read all this shit and then you sit and watch me, yeah? Yeah, just stick to the lines for Jill. Do I have sex with you before or after the audition? No, there's no, no sex. sex. None. Zero oh. sex. I'm only joking. Relax. Alright then, come on. Whenever you're ready. Fine, Jack. Walk away. Walk away like you always do. But remember this. I'm not following you anymore. I know I can do this by myself. I know I'm strong enough. I don't need you in my life anymore. I thought you loved me. It's very obvious now you don't. So just get out. Go. I don't ever want to see you again. Lads. Fucks after happening there. That was class, was Wasn't it? Yeah. Yeah, it, 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 was, it was good. So, just want to say before we start, welcome to our first day on set. We're so happy to have you all on board here and just Thank you so much for being here. Thank you to Ben's family for letting us use his family home for our first few days of shooting. So the main thing we want is a good, good atmosphere, okay? You know, I'm here to direct, you're here to act, he's here to shoot. Don't be telling anyone to do their jobs, all right? We're all doing this for the first time, so we're all in the same boat. None of this ego shit, you know, I'm the best actor, blah, blah, blah. If you have a question, it will be heard. What if we, uh... Shut the fuck up, Milo! I'm talking! Great, great. Sorry, excuse me. Yeah, you. Glasses. Who, me? Yeah, you. That's that young woman that auditioned. What are you doing here? We never hired you. I told you I, I wanted to be part of the movie. I'll do whatever you need. All right, what's your name? I'm Luke. All right, Laura. Oh, what can you do? Laura, right, would you be able to go and count how many rocks there are here? You know, for continuity, it'd be real helpful. Right, I'm on it. <laughs> 
Wait, hang on, hang on. What if we use them as our runner? Get the coffees and the teas and all that crack. All right, put up your hand if you need a tea or coffee. And uh, no, save that for a bit later, yeah. What's this more? So am I more, am I defeated or? How would you feel defeated but with a level of self-loathing as well, yeah? Right, okay. Really feel happy. What about me? What do I do? I don't want pure music. Pure music. Why don't you Try that from the top again, but just this time, just just do it better. All right. Okay. Yeah. Seriously. Right. So. Just start. You go again. Say okay. our line, and then I'll come in after you. Right. Yeah. Right, well, are you reading it? Would you know it? No, I know me lying. Oh. Yeah. All right. Right. Can we just get a little bit more light there, Jay? Uh, there. Perfect. All right. Now is everyone set? Yeah. Actors. Set. Camera. And roll it. Sound. All right. And action. I was just thinking just when I was walking away that um, maybe we uh, we should have a uh, release forms. Jesus Christ man, is that all you ever talk about? Uh, it was the first time I've ever talked about it. Look, I'm in the process of making them, okay? I'm just a bit fucking busy right now, as you can see. Oh, okay. Um, you see, I was just thinking that um, maybe I could help you out with that type of stuff. Um, like the scripts, the schedules, release forms, any of them things. And, and you'd be able to focus on directing your actors. Hmm. Um, excuse me, lads, can I have a minute of your time? Um, I need you all to sign a release form and get it back to me by the end of the day, please. So, um, yes, release form. Release form. What's this shit? It's, it's a release form. What's that? Um, well, it gives us permission to use your face, footage and permission for anything to do with the film. I need something to wipe my eyes with. No, please don't use toilet roll. Mossy, hello. Will you tell us what we're doing? Sorry, uh, uh, would you two uh, go rehearse upstairs? You know, we'll be good to go in about 10, 15 minutes. I just need to go do a sh. I just need to go upstairs, so yeah. We are two people. And one day, I, I hope that we can become one. I think it's a bit funny, life. Once you are here, once you are not. Sorry, uh, cut. Lisa, um, do you mind looking at my face? I need to see your eyes so we can bounce off each other's reactions. I 
I'm cute. <sighs> yeah, well, if you ask me, it's kind of like, uh, <clears throat> yeah, well, if you ask me, it's kind of like, oh, I forgot my lines. Such a silly sausage. Apologies. Darn it. Brown cow. You were having a bleeding stroke? No, I'm not having a stroke. It's called acting. <sighs> mm, darn it. Darn it! Do you even know how to swear? Yes, I know how to swear. Thank you. Okay. It just... It wasn't encouraged in my home, alright? I once got grounded for two weeks for saying... For saying, tits. <laughs> Say fuck. What? Why? Just say it. Go on, I want to hear you swear, Ben. Say it. I, I don't see the point. You're so uptight. Do you love acting? Yes, more than anything. Then have a bit of crack doing the thing you love. Let loose. Have some fun. Get your knob out. Well, uh, not going to do that part, but... All right, all right. Come on. Fuck. Okay. Yeah, that's a start, yeah. I'm a bad man. Try... Fuck off. Uh, fuck, fuck off. Very good, yeah. Now try your big shite bag. Um, yeah, big, sh your big shite bag. No more. Give it some gusto now. Really go for it, you big shite you bag. You big shite bag. Yeah, even more than that. Yeah, big shite bag. Yes. Now put that all together. Fuck off, you big shite bag. Fuck off, you big shite bag. <laughs> I feel great. How'd you feel after that? <laughs> great, yeah. I do have a weird feeling in my testicles. Oh, well, you might want to get that checked. Right, yeah. But apart from that, very good, yeah. I'm yeah. happy with that. Probably one of the craziest things I've ever done. And you know what? It's easy, Ben. You can call me a big shite bag any day you want. Would that not offend you, though? No. No, it's all banter. It's part of Irish culture. Right. Ireland's the only place where you can insult someone, but mean it in a caring way. Right, yeah. Boss, is ready for you when you was there? Yeah, no bother with being now. Cheers, you fucking prick. Hey lads, how are you doing? Where are you going, Luke? Oh. No way, man. Eat it! No, I need that, I need that. Give it back, please. What's wrong, Luke? It's, it's, it's just forms, just give it back. Forms I need for what? It. It's for a film. <laughs> Me and my friends are working on a film. I, I need You're that. a friend? Yeah, yeah, well, look, you don't have any friends. I do have friends, just give them back. Give them back, please, just be What do you need to do, Luke? Just fuck off, please. Wait, what'd you say? Fuck off!
Well, what do you think? It's amazing, man. <laughs> Your camera work is unreal. And look at those big ass eyes. Are you happy with that then? We'll use natural lighting and then we'll use a reflector to bring up the dark patches. Absolutely. And it'll save us loads of time as well. <sighs> look at this, man. Looks like we actually got a decent budget. And those producers said it wouldn't get made. Not getting made my whole. I didn't think it'd be this easy. I know, man. This is gonna be a breeze. <sighs> Lads, how's that makeup coming along? <sighs> oh, shit. What was on? Alright guys, so today we're going to be shooting scene 21, the scene where Ben's character drives off after an argument. So, we're going to be shooting on the road back here, big wide shot, car coming in from the right, so pretty straightforward stuff, yeah? Uh, since Ben can't drive, Jay's going to be Ben's driving double. But Jay looks nothing like Ben. What? Uh... That's really good. You just look just like him. Is that what people think I look like? No. Can we at least swap clothes or something? I mean, he literally looks nothing like me. I hope. Uh, yeah, that's a good idea, Ben. Uh, Jay, do you mind wearing the turtleneck top? Absolutely, I mind. I'm not wearing that shit. Uh, Lily, so I need you to be on traffic and pedestrian control. That means. Any cars or any people that come by, I need you to let us know so we can, you know, work around that, all right? Good. Good. Now, Jay, this is really important, all right? I'm going to give you a signal to use, and when I use this signal, you're to drive, all right? Not sooner, not after, when I use it. So you ready for this? Pay attention. Pay attention! Come on, man! This is important. So it's... It's going to be like, um... Um... All right, so just... Have you got that, yeah? All right, so... When I do that signal, then, then, then you drive. So let's get to work anyway, all right? Um, hurry up, come on! Shut up, please, brother. Okay, Luke, stay tucked right in, pal, yeah? We don't want to get you in the shot. Sorry, Luke? Yeah, Luke. That's his name. And you should start calling him by his actual name and stop giving him such a hard time, also. All right, Jesus, you good Samaritan, yeah? Fucking hell. I'm serious, man. You're bullying him. Man, I'm sure if Lily had a problem with it, he'd say something. And besides, this is just some friendly onset banter. No, it's not. All right, why don't we ask Luke and see how he feels about it? Fine then, I'm sure he's got no problem with it at all, come on. Right. Luke, Luke, come here for a sec, buddy. Jesus Christ. What the? What on this bench. Okay. Hold on, watch out, watch out. Okay, spin him, spin him, spin him, head this way. Just throw mine up. Three, two, no, you're not swing swinging. him up. Lads, you're not swinging him up. Pull him round. Pull him round. That's it. Oh my God. Mind go his easy, go Mind easy. You want a broken bone. Mind his arm. Stop that. Get down. He has not died. Just let me, let me sort this out for a minute, okay? Luke? Luke? Are you okay, buddy? You all have halos. I'm going to call you an ambulance, yeah. Luke. Yeah. No, 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 please. No. Uh, I'm not hearing, guys. He said right, he was grand. No, no I grand. Listen to him. Lads, can we not get back to work? He said he's fine. I trust him. 
Shut up. Call a fucking ambulance. It's grand. He's Look. just got ran over and he needs to go to the hospital. You selfish prick. You're the he's director. Do something. He says he's too. fine, didn't I'm he? Yes, he's fine. fine. He said, oh, you do. Yeah. We're not going to believe him, no? Look. All right, Luke. Can you stand? My mum and dad are first cousins. Oh my god, he's not good. No, 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 alright, it's a bit weird, but... Ah, come here. How many fingers am I holding up? Seven? Okay. That was close enough. Cut. That was seven. Alright, yeah, uh, call an ambulance. Yeah, you reckon? Yeah. But you're all a bunch of amateurs, yeah? Amateurs, that's who I'm working with here. Did, did I get it right? You got it right, you got it right. Good. Luke, Luke, are you okay? Should we bury him? Probably some annoyance got me feeling wavy Cause the pressure's getting less around the job Just pay me new kicks, fresh short tick girl, short skirt Don't move like that cause you make me brain hurt still The lockdown got me getting locked now Nothing else to do, I better bring the boys or chat shit Get lit, wake up, be a bitch, joints lit, bar spit, right hits, get rich Sauce gang got me looking for paper Heavy Kevy spitting bars and the flow was major Got flower on the hook, got less stick on the beat Take the music to the clubs, to the bars, to the streets I think I'm in too deep The last bit of Jimmy knocked me off my feet Now the joints get past and I'm torn and green Then the smoke fills the room and I fall asleep Yeah, I fall asleep Oh, it's your boy, you ain't too far again Pass the way, it's only five to ten Spoon out from the whiskey and the tins Wake up and then I do it all again Oh, it's your boy, you ain't too far again Pass the way, it's only five to ten Spoon out from the whiskey and the tins Wake up and then I do it all again As I sleep, we fall into a dream Stay away when the sun is with the trees Cook hands and the chill and so I breeze Ben, what did I tell you about your fucking phone? Turn it off! It's on vibrate. Well, I didn't say you could vibrate, did I? Turn it off, you muppet! I need to take this, okay? You're not leaving, you're not, you're gonna stay right there! Don't you dare, oh, don't you, that? you cheeky prick, you. We're gonna have to go again anyway, Mossy, because Milo's pole is in shot again. My knob's not even in shot. I'm talking about the boom pole. It's in shot every single time, man. It's not hard to hold it up. You're the one with the camera, so move it. I'm gonna fucking hit you now in a minute. Will you two shut up? Because I can't focus and now I'm after forgetting me line. What's me line again after he says his? Learn your lines, Lisa. Get your shit together! Maybe if I got a bit of direction, I'd know what I was doing. Um, Mossy, maybe a bit of coffee will help. Get away from me, you piece of shit! Sorry, sorry. Yeah, of course, Mr. Delaney. I'll move over here. Piss in his coffee! No, do not piss in my coffee. Not another word from you, do you hear me? Jay, the bags, they're still in shot. Those bags there? The ones I'm pointing at, the ones that are in the shot, the ones that are right behind the two actors, man. Oh yeah, I asked you they in shot and he said no. Ten minutes ago I said, Jay, will you move those bags there in the background, they're in the shot. It's just a thought to be out focused and have to film us. Move the fucking bags. I'd shove that camera so far up your arse, you'd be shitting lenses. That's impossible. It's not, I've seen it happen before. Sure lads, it's all a bit of crack. Oh, fucking hell! Sit the hell down, okay? Everyone, we're just, we're gonna shut the fuck up and we're gonna do this scene, okay? Marcy. What? I need to talk to you. <laughs>
for a second. It's important. Oh, no. I don't care if your fucking parents have died. We are doing this scene. Just two seconds, please. Mossy looks very intense. Fuck you! Hope everything's okay. I'm not so sure. Come on, man. Listen up! What's wrong with you? You won't believe what this asshole's done. What's he done? He's gone and got himself a job in London. He's fucking off to England. Good man. Fair play then. Oh, congratulations. Well Thanks. done. <laughs> Look. I'm, I'm sorry guys, but yes, I've got a paid job in a sitcom in England. I, I feel terrible, but I can't, I can't pass this up. What the fuck are we supposed to do now, huh? Calm down, Mossy. Look, it's a shit situation, but this is Ben's dream. You cannot ask him to pass up this opportunity. Yes, I can! How is he not pissed off? Look, it's frustrating. But we're all doing this for free, and Ben's been offered a paying job on a big set. No, 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 it's bullshit is what it is. So, is that it? No, we can finish the film without our lead. You nerd! Marcy, I'm sorry. Okay. That's, that's it. That's all there is to it. So I'm sorry. No, 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 no. You don't apologise to him. Fuck him. I'm sorry to you guys too, by the way. It's okay, Ben. I think I should leave. Fine then. See you guys. It was a pleasure to work with all of you. I think you're all great. We don't even want you here. We don't need you. You're, you're a shit actor anyway. Classy. You told him, man. Why don't we shoot it again and find a different actor? No, 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 we can't shoot it again. It wouldn't be the same. We, we had something special on camera and... Ben was perfect for the part, the stupid bastard. Why not start working on a different movie? Obviously you started working on different scripts. Because I want to make this movie! Calm down. We're only here to help. You're right. I'm sorry, Luke. I didn't mean to shout at you. It's fine. All those producers were right. This movie's never gonna get made. I wasted my time, and I wasted all of your time. Look, it's getting late, lads. <clears throat> it's been a long day. Let's just talk about this tomorrow.
I know the movie isn't finished, but we made a lot of great memories with great people. And we have you to thank for that. You didn't waste any of our time. You gave us something to look forward to. If it wasn't for you, this movie wouldn't have happened. Hello? Marcy. Listen, um... I know we're not exactly on good terms, but, um... I mean, I'll cut straight to the point. Uh, the job in England fell through. So, if you still want to finish the movie... I'd love to come and finish it off with you guys. Uh, if you'll have me. Hold on one, one second. Yes! Fuck you! Sorry about that. I'm really sorry to hear that, man. Um, I know how it is. Uh, it's a cutthroat business. It is what it is, I guess. So, um, what do you say? You all right? No, I'm, I'm okay, look. Just, just drive, come on. We have stuff to do, we have to get to set. There's loads of work we have to do today. You, you have a black eye? What happened to you? Oi. I'll be back in two minutes. Don't hurt them. What? Just promise me. Don't hurt them. Yeah, I won't hurt them, no problem. Thank you.
Hey. We got a wallet. Got a phone. I got a few phones there, so you take that. Thank you. Hey. So no one bullies you except us, right? So, before we begin, I just want to say, welcome back to Ben. It's good to have you. Welcome back, Ben. So, today we're going to be shooting our big fight scene. So it's going to start off with Lisa at the bar. Jay's going to come over and sexually assault her. And then our hero, Ben, is going to come up and try to stop him. He's going to get punched, and that's going to be the end of the scene, all right? So obviously this is going to be a very dangerous scene, so you know, we want to go through as many rehearsals as possible. Make sure everyone is as comfortable as possible, and that we all know it off by heart, yeah? Does that sound good to everyone? Yeah. yeah. Okie dokie. Your time to shine, Jay. Get up all night learning me lines. You don't have any lines. What was I reading then? And action! Come on, homie, will you? Me ma's not home tonight. I have a free gas. No. Come on, come home, me, will you? Oh. Hey! She's alright, man. Yeah? Leave her alone. Don't touch me! Actually hit him. Are you okay? Ben, you're right. Did you get that? Uh no, we're actually gonna have to go again. It was out of focus. Oh my Jesus! Alright, can we just one more time? Sorry, Ben. And this time just try getting in focus. Okay, Jay, don't hit him. Don't actually hit him. Do what I taught you, but don't actually hit him. Guy, I'm not supposed to Guy, don't hit him. Don't hit him. Don't actually right. hit him. Go on. Right. right, okay. Action! Hey! She's alright, man. Alright? I think you should leave. Cool. That's a wrap. Um, just to double confirm with everyone, do I all have your release forms? Yeah? Um, mine's in my bag there, I haven't signed it yet, but uh, two seconds, I'll get it over to you. No problem at all, Benny. No worries, my guy. Can you shut up and have a drink? Jesus Christ, don't mind the release forms. <laughs> okay. You see, it's not just about rubbing sausages together. Yeah, yeah, I know, yeah. It's, uh, <laughs> it's just a bit fucking weird, man.
So how long do you think it'll take to edit the whole thing? I don't know. If I don't get any work, about a month or two, three maybe? Honestly guys, I'm just... I'm so excited to see it come together, do you know what I mean? Like, you guys are the nicest bunch of pricks I've ever worked with. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. Um... Oh, uh... Do you mind if I take this? Two seconds? It's my agent, so... <laughs> Hello? Hello, Ben. So the above you, mate. Now you're, you're grand. What's the crack? So, do you know the way you suddenly lost a part of the BBC series in London? Yeah, well, are they reconsidering or...? Well, I done some digging around and I found out that someone told the BBC that you was a strong drug user and a flat earther. What? I mean, never mind the drugs, but a fucking flat earther. I, I don't even know what to say to that. What, who would tell them that? I don't know, but I've got a few friends down at BBC and they got a phone number for you. Okay, um, can you send me that? What's the hardest part to eat on a vegetable? The wheelchair. <laughs> So I've been saying this to her all night, and she didn't even care. You're a scumbag, man. What the hell? He's the reason I lost my job in London. Yeah, you told the casting agent I was on drugs? And a flat earther? Are you insane? Are you a flat earther too? Yeah, alright, it's, it's true. Why would you do something like that? Because if I didn't, we wouldn't have been able to make the film. I, I, I did this for you. No, you didn't. You did this because you're a selfish asshole. I'm sorry, but if it wasn't for me, none of you would be here. We wouldn't have made a film without me. No, because of you. Not you. Not you. Me. Well, I haven't signed my release form. So what are you going to do now? You wouldn't be that childish. <sighs> if you use a fucking frame of that footage, I will take you to court so fast your head will spin. This is not on. Oh, shut the fuck up. Without us, you'd still be some junkie mechanic. And you'd be a weirdo. And you a loser. And you, Jay, you're a criminal. And don't even get me started on you. You waste of space, piece of shit actor that nobody, nobody is ever going to want to see on screen. I think you need to leave. What? Just go, man. Fine.
Hej. I am. Um... I finished editing the film. Uh, that that's great. Are you happy with it? Uh, yeah. I mean, um, I could do with a second opinion. Uh, would you? I, I don't know. Maybe be interested in coming over and watching it tonight. Uh, not tonight, man. Sorry, I have a thing. Yeah, no. Of course. Um, no worries. I, I just mean not tonight, like I can tomorrow night. Uh, tom tomorrow, yay. Yeah. Tomorrow's perfect, yeah. You all right? Yeah, um... Rob, what's wrong? Ever since we were kids, we wanted our names up on the big screen. And now we have. I'm just so proud. And you should be, man. I mean, you shot every scene in the film. You deserve to be. Look, you are a prick. But this is brilliant. Look, man, I'm... I'm really sorry for what I've done. It's absolutely horrible what you've done to Ben. But if you didn't, you wouldn't have this finished product. Yeah, but I probably didn't need to ruin his career to get it. Aye, get over it. What do you think? Who cares? Let's just start whacking this into festivals, man. I can't. He never signed the release form and... You know what he said. If I do anything with it, he's gonna take me to court. Do you actually believe him? Man, he's an actor. He just worked his bollocks off for free in a feature movie that he's the lead character in. I don't want to take the risk. Just show it to him, man. Just show it to him. I guarantee you, he'd be blown away by it. Hi, Ben. Why, Ben? Hello? He hello? Look, Ben, I know I'm the last person you want to talk to right now. Look, I, I, I know that what I've done to you is terrible and selfish and, and you've no reason to forgive me. But if you could just see the amazing work that you and everyone else done, you... I don't know. Here, look, I, I have a copy of the film on me. I, just, just watch it, and if, if you don't like it, then you never have to speak to me again. I'm sorry, Ben.
a premiere. Like a real premiere, like 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 in Cannes. You know Cannes. What is Cannes? Cannes, Cannes Film Festival. In in France, all the big directors, big actors, they're all there. It's the place to be. Oh, and Jay, Jay, cause in France, you can be all like, Je m'appelle Jay. <laughs> Look, <clears throat> what Mossy done was bad form, all right? He's a dickhead, we all know he's a dickhead, but this isn't about Mossy. Don't go for Mossy, go for yous, all right? We all work really hard on this. Do you want to hear the sound? It's amazing. You want to see yourself on the big screen? It's beautiful. You want to see everything that you helped with, Luke? Okay, and I think if Ben can forgive Mossy after what he done, then maybe you can too. So this is it lads, this place can hold about 250 people and I can give it to you for uh, 600. Yeah. All right, we'll take it. Should book us in? Coming. Uh, we're here showing off uh, our new movie today. It's, it's a low-budget film, so please don't be expecting a Hollywood blockbuster. Okay, just um, if you're a pervert, you know, keep your hands to yourself while the lights are down. That that was a joke. All right, well, all you can do now is just sit back, relax, and just enjoy the show. Thanks. I'll give a speech to you after.
Thank you. Thank you so much. Just before you go, I just want to say a few words. I wrote the script five years ago and I didn't bother trying to get it made until recently. Now, I made this film with a group of fantastic people who honestly, I, I couldn't have made this film without. So to my amazing cast and crew, would you come down and join me please? <laughs> First, the man behind every shot of the movie, our director of photography, and my best friend, Robert Kelly. <laughs> Next, we have our sound engineer, who is the best ASMR recorder you'll ever meet, so please like and subscribe, Mr. Milo Walsh. Next we have our two lead cast members who've both done absolute stellar performances. Mr. Ben Kinsla and Lisa Walker. <laughs> and the man who was behind every aspect of the film, from makeup to costume to the stunts. We have Mr. Jason Weller. Thank you. I'm doing the film. I'm going the And last but not least, to the most dedicated, hard-working man I've ever met, who brought nothing but positive energy to this whole shoot, who, honestly, we couldn't have done the film without. Ladies and gentlemen, Mr. Luke! The oh, fuck? Uh, Luke! Luke! Clearly, you're driven, okay, and, and, and you're motivated, okay? But you are gonna have to get tougher skin if you wanna survive in this business, right? You are gonna be here no every single day. It is gonna be a long, cold, dark, negative journey. Okay, now I'm sorry that I couldn't give you the story that you wanted to hear today, but in my opinion, you need to burn this script, you need to write something else, because this movie is never getting made. I disagree.
Cause the pressure's getting less around the job Just baby, new kicks, fresh short Tick, yeah, short skirt Don't move like that Cause you make me brain hurt still The lockdown got me getting locked now Nothing else to do I better bring the boys Or chat shit, get lit Wake up, bit bits Joints lit, bars spit Right hits, get rich Sauce gang got me looking for paper Heavy, heavy spitting bars And the flow was major Got flower on the hook Got less on the beat Take the music to the clubs To the bars, to the streets I think I'm in too deep The last bit of Jimmy Knocked me off my feet Now the joints get past And I'm torn and green Then the smoke fills the room And I fall asleep Yeah, I fall asleep Oh, you go You went too far again Pass the on It's only four to ten Spoon out from the whiskey And the tents Wake up and then I do it all again Oh, you go You went too far again Pass the on It's only four to ten Spoon out from the whiskey And the tents Wake up and then I do it all again As you sleep Oh, you fall into a dream Sail away where the swan Has made the trees Cook hands and a chill And so 